Hi, my name is Jacques de Wett, and I'm the National Head of Sales for PSG Wealth. We will have a brief discussion on investing for retirement, considering your retirement investment horizon and why moving into cash before retirement is not always the right call. We will have a brief glance at the retirement landscape and what it really entails, then how you can ensure that you make the right decisions prior to retirement and also avoid general mistakes after retirement. We will then conclude with a final note and takeaway. Your horizon and investment plan should focus on your total investment timeline and not just your individual parts. Investors in general think that retirement is the end game, but retirement is only a point in time during your investment guideline timeline and not the end point. There is still a very long horizon post retirement that needs to be carefully considered. The actions and decisions investors make both pre- and post-retirement contribute to the reality of far too many ill-equipped retirees in South Africa. Investors are meant to ideally build up a big capital base in the pre-retirement phase, but many simply fail to accumulate enough. Post-retirement, some investors also fail to grow their capital base sufficiently, while others have income drawdown rates that are just too high. There are typically three common reasons for not accumulating enough before retirement. The first is allocating too little to growth assets. The second factor is not saving early enough. And the third one is failing to consider how much you will need and cashing in what you have already saved. There is no need to suddenly become overly conservative when you are at retirement. Sure, you will need to draw an income from your investment, but you don't need to put all of your investment in cash. A healthy allocation to growth assets such as equity is absolutely necessary. It is not always necessary to move assets from growth to conservative assets as investors approach retirement, as the investment term post-retirement is usually longer than expected. Looking at the graph, it is clear that over the longer term, growth assets like equity outperform conservative assets like cash and bonds. Not saving early enough. By starting earlier, you significantly enhance your chances of accumulating more money to, retirement, to retire with. And as we know, every drop counts. The graph illustrates the positive effect of starting investing earlier in, for example, a tax-free investment. You will need more after retirement than you think. Longer life expectancies mean that investors need to start saving as early as possible and then also continue saving for as long as possible. Medical advances mean that lifespans are increasing and investors often don't realize how long their retirement years could last. General mistakes after retirement. Drawing an income at a higher rate than the investment is earning means that investors erode capital. If this continues for too long, they run the risk of depleting their capital. Retirees can often not continue with the same lifestyle post-retirement. So following sound investment strategies post-retirement can help in managing post-retirement income. And as we all know, you need growth assets to see your investment going the distance. So how can we help you? Make sure you do your homework before retirement and make the right choices now to ensure you have enough when you retire and that your savings can go the distance. Thank you so much.